So I'm just going to show a couple of quick ways here to set up a, a quick Twitch stream um, to record videos. And the reason why we are using Twitch Studio in this case instead of just live streaming on Twitch is that we need to actually record a separate video file and upload it. And for Twitch, you need to be a partner or affiliate in order to record a separate file and then upload it. You can live stream to, to either studio or just to the browser version of Twitch. But in this case, we want a separate file because we want to load it into Adobe Premiere for editing and then re-upload it later. So I'm going to recommend using Twitch Studio in this case. And it's a free download, so you don't need to pay for it. Um, you can obtain it from the Twitch TV site and there is a free download button. It says for Windows 8 or newer. I don't know if it actually works for Mac, but it looks like for the most part Windows is kind of recommended. So once you download Twitch Studio, it kind of looks a little bit like this and you can open it to start customizing your own screen window. The reason why this is important is if you have a text box or a chat that you want to cover up, this is how you can do it in the window. And we have, we have separate windows here that we could potentially use. Our gameplay window is the main window. So I'm gonna edit that real quick. And to add a way to cover up Part of our window we need to add a layer so there's some layer options here i'm going to do add layer and we're going to add an image and then add so here's a little image on this option i'm going to click browse and i'm going to select an image so it's just going to kind of put it wherever randomly on your window i'm going to adjust this to be in the lower left corner just make it as big as you want and it's pretty good at snapping so it can kind of do a little bit of control for the formatting for you. So now we have an image here and if our text box showed up here in the lower left hand corner viewers would no longer be able to see that they will just see your image. So after that's added, added there's a couple other things we could do, we could change maybe if we don't like the border color here on our window we can change that we go to game capture and here's our border option we can change this to whatever color we want so change it to purple and you can see our our border shows up here so they have some other options you can customize your window as you'd like and then once you're done hit save and this is kind of what your what your gameplay window is going to look like right now, it is a little bit awkward because it's broadcasting our actual Twitch window. Normally in this area right here, you might have another application running and then your image covering the top. So this is kind of a quick, quick way to set up a stream. And once you're ready, all you have to do is start stream and this will live stream directly to your Twitch account. You do need to be logged in in order to do this. So you might have to set up a separate Twitch account in order to live stream. If you want to just record a video file, then you click right here and select record video. And once the video start, starts recording, there is a stop button here you can click on that and stop the recording.